Mercado Vial TV, un mundo de máquinas. Good afternoon. My name is Stéphane Dieu. I'm excavator project manager for Europe. And I would like to introduce you this new concept excavator. This new concept excavator is planned to be launched around 2024, 2025. But you could see that this machine is already working. This machine is fully developed with a new technology. We will have an undercarriage. On this undercarriage, we will have a battery. So the target is to have electric transmission, but also electric regeneration during the braking. Same concept at the top. The top, we have a battery pack inside with electric motor for the swing. So every time we will brake with the swing, we will recharge the battery. This machine could be with an engine, a diesel engine equipped, so a kind of hybrid machine. So I could choose between the two technology. Or if the customer is looking only for 100% electric machine, we will remove this engine and we will add a third battery to get, I would say, more autonomy. The concept is to recharge the battery in two hours and to get around eight hours working time. About the capacity of the battery, we are speaking about 300 kilowatt hour per battery. So it means that if we have three batteries, we will be around 900 kilowatt hour. We don't speak about onboard charger, we speak about external charger because we are looking for fast recharge. Previously, we were working about the future. Okay, now we are talking about today, now. So this machine is ready to be launched. This machine will appear in the European market in 2023. So this machine is fully electric and we are speaking about 20 kilowatt hour battery with two ways of charging. Inboard charging, so where I will get the 100% fully charged battery in six hours, for example, during the night. But if I want to recharge the battery really fast because I have heavy job to do, I could fulfill the battery at 80%, but in only one hour. But for that, I will need another charger, an external charger. So I will say the hydraulic concept, the hydraulic flow, everything is the same. Just we change the way to power the machine. So we replace a diesel engine by a battery pack. So this machine will be dedicated for city application, but also for inside application. For now, it's our first model we launch now. But of course, we are working on more and more models in the future. Let me introduce the first DX1000 for the European market. So this is a 100 ton excavator dedicated for mine and quarry application. Today, the main focus on this machine was productivity on fuel consumption per ton. If you look here, we say with one liter of fuel, we could move 26 tons of material. This was the main target. How we succeed on that? We succeed on that with a really developed hydraulic circuit. So we work today with a three pumps, but three pumps of 500 liters per minute each. So it means maximum hydraulic capacity, 1,500 liters per minute. We will have one pump, will be fully dedicated for the swing when we will need to use a lot of the swing. For example, I'm loading a truck at 180 degrees. So what I want, I want the swing really fast compared to the boom. Now, opposite side, if I am loading a truck at something like 50 degrees, I want to go really fast with the boom and slow with the swing. So this pump, I could dedicate from the cabin where I want to send the oil. If I want swing priority, this pump will boost only the swing. If I want boom priority, this pump will go to the, to the boom. Important for a machine like that, it's the comfort. Because an operator will stay eight hours a day seated on the cabin. So for this machine, we have really high level comfort seats. You could see that I have a 360 degrees camera. So it's for operator, he don't need to think about what is around because he will have a total view of what around the machine. The hydraulic is really precise, really smooth. So we could accumulate the movement really easily. If you have a look on the shoes, you could see that you have narrow shoes with really heavy duty shoes and two double grosser. 
If you ever look at the front, you could see short boom and short arm for the maximum penetration force. And about the bucket, we speak about a 6.8 cubic meter bucket. This machine is able to move 1,200 tons every hour. The bucket we show today is a rock bucket dedicated for rock application. You will have the choice of the type of the bucket, the profile of the bucket, depending what you are doing.